What's up, YouTube? It's me, Casey, and I'm back with another video. Um, this is another quick vlog before I head to work and school this time, and I just wanted to give you guys a head up. Heads up. Sorry about that. So just be well prepared. First of all, Kirby makes his way to Dreamland on October the 24th. So all you Kirby fans who are ready for Kirby Dreamland, be on the lookout because it's coming out October the 24th. And just as a reminder, I'd like to tell you guys that Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword is going to be coming out on the 20th of November. So you guys are also fans of that. Pick those two titles up. Even though they are the only two titles that is coming out for the Wii this year. Sadly, that's worth buying in my opinion. In other news, Fable 4 has been rumored uh, and actually slated to come out 2013. Now, I don't know if this is actually a rumor, uh, but it says the news come from the most recent issue of Official Xbox Magazine. So, Official Xbox Magazine, that shouldn't be a rumor then. According to this issue, we can look forward to Fable Cycle to continue with a proper controller base Fable 4 in 2013. Now, all you guys seen Fable Journeys at uh, E3. And we thought it was utter crap. They were saying, oh man, it's going to revolutionize the Fable series. And it looked like uh, one of those rail shooters. Not to, you know, rag on rail shooters, but, you know, it's Fable. It's supposed to be running around and all this stuff. So look for your exclusive, you Xbox fans. Sometime during 2013. In other news, um, let's see. Sonic 4, Episode 2, not due into 2012. It says, will this still hit WiiWare? It says, Sonic Team head to whatever his name is, Takeshi Inuzuka, has revealed that the following, the follow-up 2010 platformer of Sonic the Hedgehog 4 will not launch until 2012 at its earliest. So this may be a couple of issues. Maybe um, they're having some technical issues or something like that. I would like you guys to read the article below. I cannot read all of it. If you guys are interested, read more about it. And most likely I have the articles posted up when I get back home. Because I have no time for it now. Um... <clears throat> Also, in other news, Mortal Kombat Arcade Collection has an official release date announced. So, um, supposed to be coming out for Xbox Live and Windows PC and PlayStation Network on August the 31st of 2011. So, you guys who are just fanning for that old school, and I mean old school Mortal Kombat, you guys need to pick this game up because this new one that came out, uh -uh. That's really not a big deal to me. A lot of people are on that. I'm not really a huge fan of that Mortal Kombat. I like the throwback one. Now, if they make this game online and then bring it back to Evo, I'll probably reconsider. Sorry about that, you guys. I just got through eating breakfast. <laughs> Alright. A rumor. Uh, Nintendo is ready in big announcement next month. So stay tuned for September, what is it, the 13th? Nintendo is supposed to unveil something brand new. And since this is probably not Wii U related, since they are, they are most likely supposed to be focusing on the 3DS, you can expect it's going to be probably a brand new, I don't know, Zelda, Mario... Heck, we could probably see Earthbound or Metroid Dread. You know, I'm just throwing stuff out there. We don't know for sure, so stay tuned. September the 13th, they're supposed to be announcing something real huge. And let me see what day it is on that. Because if it's not a big deal, then I should be able to cover it. It's on a Tuesday, so maybe on Tuesday night I probably can do some coverage. And, you know, I will get to that as soon as possible. Last but not least, a rumored Nintendo preparing dual analog for the 3DS revamp. Let me see. It says, for current owners, Nintendo engineers are allegedly developing an, an attachment for the 3DS that will add a second analog stick or circle pad to the equation. Apparently, 
selling around 10 bucks. Now, I don't see how this is going to happen, and I think it's also weird. It's probably going to be under the deep, uh, not the D-pad, but the, uh, the buttons, you know, like X, Y, A, and B. Uh, it's probably going to be under that, but, I mean, whatever. I mean, then they say that they were not going to revamp the 3DS, so that means it's going to be rumors floating around that it's going to be maybe a new 3DS at actually when they said they were not going to make a new 3DS. So, I don't know what Nintendo is up to. They are pretty much jumping the gun right here, if this rumor is true. But, doing analog, I can see them doing that for a revamp. So, this may be tossing hints around that they may be. People just need to keep their mouth shut and just let it flow. And with that said, K91 out. I gotta head to school and work. I'll see you guys later, and I'll try my best to uh, put the titles in the description as I go along in the school day. Peace. I'm out.